Good morning, everybody. It is day two at MegaCon. I just woke up. I'm in my hotel. I'm at the Avanti Palms Resort just down the road from the convention center. I've never been here before. It's very nice. And uh, it's uh, kind of nice not having to drive all the way back home every single day at the convention. So I think this might be my new thing. Just go to convention day one go to a nearby hotel for the night, go to convention day two, then go home, and then do that for, like, just go back and forth for the next couple of days, which usually somebody joins me, so I'm not always driving, so it's kind of nice. But I wanted to show you this view. Check out the view. That is Universal Studios Volcano Bay. And uh, last night it was illuminated all blue and at one point it started fluctuating and it turned red. I was like, ooh, is it going to explode? Is it going to have a fireworks show or something? And I was like, nah, they're not going to have a fireworks show right next to all these hotels from a volcano at 11 o'clock at night or whatever it was. But right over there, oh, yeah, I can actually see it now. Let's take a look. You have the top of Hogwarts at Universal. That is so cool. And then right over here, you've got so you can see the top of a couple other rides, and then the uh, the lighthouse from Islands of Adventure. And then way in the distance, you can barely see it, but that is the Contemporary Resort over at Disney. Still quite a ways away. But uh, still pretty awesome that I could see that. I remember used, I used to stay there when uh, I used to go visit my dad during his work convention. And, uh, and then we would go to the parks. The convention doesn't start for another, let's see, it's almost 8 o'clock. It doesn't start for another two hours. So I'm going to hang out here. It's kind of nice just to be able to chill out, hang out, relax, and not have to make that drive. Oh! So it's kind of nice. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the first day of interviews. I'm hoping to get a lot more today. I will not be carrying around my purchases, uh, which was a pain in the butt because um, I bought four of those um, V1 Tech acrylic art pieces and they're all four of them together are surprisingly heavy. and. It was a pain, <laughs> but I managed, but I won't be doing that. I'll just be backpacked today, so that'll be nice. Enjoy the rest of the interviews, and I'll see you on the showroom floor.